Welcome to clickmyproject.com Project title is Internet Traffic Classification by Aggregating Correlated Navy Base Prediction This project coming under the domain Data Mining which is followed by Information Security Now going to domain explanation Data Mining is the process of analyzing data from different perspective and summarizing it into useful information in one of the number of analytical tools for analyzing a data. It allows users to analyze the data from many different dimensions. It is the process of finding large relational database. It has a four main relationship classes, cluster, classification and association role mining. Now going to briefly explain the project. In this project, improve Navy based traffic classifier, which is a given input. In existing system, this classification can only classify the small set of training data. In our proposed system, improve the large data set and give better classification result. This paper presents a novel traffic classification scheme to improve the classification performance. In Navy based scheme, traffic flows are described by using the correlated feature subset selection and flow correlation information is modeled. Traffic classification method is proposed to aggregate the Navy based prediction of the correlated flows. We also present on analysis on prediction error sensitivity of the aggregation. Our proposed scheme show that classification performance can achieve much better classification performance than the existing state of art of traffic classification method. In that method have C4.5 and KNN classification methods. These methods demonstrate superior traffic classification performance. It achieve only 65% of classification performance. To overcome the existing problem, we have to move on the Navy based classifier. Now going to explain data flow diagram. First we have to establish the testing data set. Our empirical study used the real world data set that is network traffic trace named as wide traffic flow which are randomly selected from the wide data set. First step of our process have to load a data set into database. Then it will be used for a classification process. Mostly all of the classification process is beginning with the pre-processing. Here also we have to do the same thing. Pre-processing is done by correlation feature subset selection that is used to remove the irrelevant and redundant feature from the feature set. Feature subset selection and significantly improved classification performance of many supervised classification algorithm. Then how to do a navy based classifier. Why we are going to choose this classifier to our scheme? Because it has a demonstrate high classification speed and good performance. It is easy to produce the probability of traffic class. Bayes theory can minimize the average classification error. The theory used for aggregate predictor. The decision rule is used to classify the final result. Finally, you have to achieve best classified result as a output. Now going to project demo. Before going to run a program, we must install a NetBeam and VAM server. VAM server or a package of independently created programs installed on computers. VAM server is used to access the data set. PHP MyAdmin which provide a graphical user interface for the MySQL database manager. First we have to start a VAM server. Now VAM server is started. After that we have to open a NetBean. Here this is our project. Here home.java is the first form of our project. 
so have to right click our project then run the file now we have to enter into our project in very first step of our project first we have to load our input here white dot text is our input of our project so we have to select the input and open the file now the file is open into the text area after that we have to insert the particular file into data set now the data are loaded into database after that we have to show the data these all the data are inserted into our database now we have to take this database into our project in first process of our project is feature subset selection in this project feature subset selection is do by correlation coefficient formula so in correlation coefficient we have to first calculate sum of the attribute after that we have to square root of the particular attributes here we have to do a sum of attributes and square root of the particular attributes are done after that we have to do a sum of x y that is mm, this is a first uh, yeah, x is a first attribute of our project and y is the second attribute of our project so we have to multiply these two and give the result of a particular attribute after that this is a whole formula for a correlation coefficient so this formula is calculated and show the result for the correlation coefficient from this formula we have to find the feature subset selection that is which one having a high value that only a statistical feature of our project this is a statistical features of our project why we have to do a feature subset selection because we have to do a large attribute means it make us some error so we have to pre process our project that is pre processing is the remove the irrelevant data from our project so the other two fields are uh, un unwanted to our project so we have to remove the two attributes then we have to pre process our project now the pre processed data are here so we have to do our uh, next process from this data because uh, it have to reduce the time also memory then we have to do a navy base prediction that is navy base classifier before going to a navy base classifier we have to must cluster our uh, data set so data are first clustered now the clustered data are displayed here that is uh, which one uh, having a which cluster that should be defined in here then we have to do a bayesian classifier that is uh, p of a by b that is uh, which one is a class this is a class factor in the particular class how many clusters are have and which how many data are inside the particular cluster that will be defined in here then have to do a p of a and p of b that is a particular attribute only have a how many data in a particular cluster after that you have to do a final that is uh, this is a cluster that is in our project have a three cluster and this is a data that is this is a 28 27 and 26 and 25 these are four datas in included into our project after that we have to from the bayesian classifier in next step of our project is decision tree that is uh, how to improve our classification accuracy so we have to do a decision rule first we have to find the matrix of our data set so here matrix formation of our project is done after that we have to calculate information gain of our project after that we have to calculate entropy for the particular attributes here entropies are calculated after that we have to do a gain finally we have to give the classification that is how many clusters are there and how many data are included in the particular cluster it how to improve the classification accuracy also finally we have to do a aggregate cluster classification this classification define uh, particular class and also that particular class having how many cluster that will be defined in aggregate classifier finally we have to do a analysis for that is it shows how many instances are in there and we have to how many 
data are we have to take into our project that is after pre subset selection how many data we have to do then how many data are how correctly classified that will be specified in here after that we have to do the error factor of our particular process then final analysis of our part this is the accuracy part of our project that is in existing system that is state of art of method it have a uh, high accuracy compared to the previous technique and also to give a error factor that is uh, error will be reduced from the range that is the previous system into now prayer error range or minimized from highest to lowest that is compared to previous algorithm into current algorithm main conclusion of our project is jaffe classification scheme which can be effectively improve the classification performance by using navy based classifier and reduce error prediction that can be achieved thank you